Hey guys, this is Yanis from Corsair. As always, we're in FilmSource Garage, and today I want to show you some insights of how we're gonna call the Viper. We're gonna finish a Dodge Viper. Uh, it's a beautiful car. It's it, probably about 20 years old, but it only has like 10,000 miles on it, so it's in really good condition. What we did, we did a two-stage polish on it, but we actually polished as a final stage, we polished the paint actually three more times because we were playing with some compounds and some pads, and we figured out you know, what, what was the best and I'm gonna show you the result. So here we are, here we are with the Viper, Dodge Viper. The owner of this beautiful car uh, was a fan of this car for a very long time. And what he told me, he said, one day I just figured out, I'm gonna press the button and I'm just gonna get it. So here it is. The car is in spectacular condition after we worked on it, obviously. So the paint is about 20 years old. So paint on these bad boys can be really soft, okay? So the, luckily, uh, none of the previous owners, so this owner has, uh, made any attempts to polish it himself, uh, which means the paint is not that damaged and it hasn't been wiped dry, you know, because what I want to tell you and what I've, what I've always mentioned to everybody, what scratches surfaces, the paint and glare coat, everything is friction, friction. So anytime you rub something against the paint, it technically damages the paint. Um, ideally, if you, let's say now on a clean surface, obviously we can, we can wipe it as much as we want to pretty much on a clean surface because there's no, there's no contaminants between, between a clear coat and a cloth. And as you can imagine, the clear coat is harder than this uh, microfiber cloth. So I just wanna show you a quick insight of how we apply ceramic coating. So this coating is by my favorite brand, SB3. The coating is called Alpha, which is a five year coating, 9H in strength. So that's the 9H, people are confused. What is 9H? Well, what is 9H? 9H is the hardness. So your car's clear coat is usually rated around 3H to 4H. That's the, how hard your clear coat is on, on average on a car. Um, this product makes your clear coat actually 9H. So it's pretty much three times more durable than your normal clear coat, which means what? Well, it's, it's easier, easy to care for. And it also doesn't um, scratch the car that easy. It's not scratch resistant like PPF, like fan protection film. However, so some minor scratches with towels and stuff, there's, there's, there's a less chance you're gonna scratch your clear coat uh, if your car is ceramic coated. So we take a few drops of SB3, probably about four or five, like that. Hey, what we do is we slowly level it out. We kind of wipe it on. We can wipe pretty much every direction that we want. Ideally, on the bigger surfaces, you want to just wipe in one direction. Wipe it on, and then, and then we'll leave it for about 45 seconds till it flashes. Flashing is, it's kind of like, almost like a rainbow effect. What happens, the coating, it's a chemical reaction between your clear coat and your coating, and uh, it bonds. So then after, we use a wet uh, cloth method uh, where Danny comes in. So this is pr pretty much flash. So he's, he's taking wet cloth method what he does is he removes the excess coating um, and then he buffs, buffs it off with a fresh microfiber towel. And then if the coating is leveled, what we try to pay attention to is the high spots. So the smudges like you can see on, on, on a car after waxing and stuff, we cannot have any, any high spots. Uh, the high spots is, is what we try to get rid of. And once the high spots has, have been removed, uh, we're gonna let the coating sit for 24 hours. That's gonna cure the coating and it's gonna look super glossy. 